Hey guys, and welcome back to Castle Crush. And today we are here, and I am in uh, Master 2 League right here, but I am actually getting kind of close to Master 3. So in this video, we're going to be trying to push up to Master 3. I've been working on this for like an hour or so now, and I thought I'd start recording. I waited until I got to this point here, 4,537 trophies, specifically because I'm afraid I may drop a bit, so who knows how long this will take. Um, I don't think I'm just going to win two or three straight matches necessarily. So the deck I'm using here, it is a Skeleton uh, Skull Queen Spectre Valkyrie Catapult deck. It's a variation of the one I've used in some previous videos, and it surprisingly still works pretty well because these are still kind of strong cards. The uh, Skull Queen and Spectre, it, they just work well together. These cards work well together, and these skeletons can be a problem. Um, you know, they can block your opponent from being able to get to the um, Catapult, as well as the Spectre can also block them from getting to the Catapult. And then, I don't know, the Valkyrie, I just kind of threw it in there for fun, because it helps sort of speed up the deck and really... Um, you know, it works pretty well there. In the previous version, I had a Skull King, but I decided that that was just taking too long to get going. And that was one of the biggest problems and reasons why this deck couldn't seem to get further because um, the start of the match was so hard. So I lowered the average mana cost of the cards in the deck a little bit. And now it seems to be working a lot, a lot better. So I also got rid of one of the extra crystals because in the end game situations, you know, if the match went on longer, I realized that the extra crystals, you know, having two of them in the deck was just giving me a bunch of them in my hand and they weren't very useful at the end of the game. So yeah, just made some adjustments there. So let's go ahead and open up these chests and see if we get anything good. So nothing too great. Um, always worth trying. Victory chest, potentially something good here. No. But I did get some gold. As you can see, I have enough gold to actually get the Necromancer, I think, from the store, but I haven't seen it yet. I've been waiting and waiting and waiting. I'll be honest, I didn't check like every day, but I've checked every day I've been playing, and I haven't seen it yet, so I'm still waiting for the Necromancer. <laughs> When it shows up, I will get it with my gold, and then I will make a video with it. So let's jump right in and hope that I can pull this off. I haven't pushed trophies very much in quite a long time here. I've been slowly pushing back up, though, but for a handful of matches before that, I was really blitzing my way through. I think I need to get back to establishing control of the map early because that's partly what was working for me. If they get on my side of the the uh, field here then I start to have a lot of problems um, because if they play anything that's hard for me to counter I don't have time to work up a counter to it so let's try and clear some of this stuff really need to work on clearing it um, quickly here so we're gonna go with the skull queen because I'm just trying to remove the stuff that's on my side of the field really quickly and then we'll go for our skeleton's legion not so good in a way because i do want to get that boneyard out while i still have cards in my hand um but i'm gonna have to just play it because again trying to give the skull queen some help uh so let's get rid of that genie and then we'll play another specter just because I wanted to make sure I could play it while there was stuff out there. This match is looking a lot better, but they did take out my Skull Queen, so... My current thought is let's play the Catapult since they're pretty low health. I may be able to just quickly take this out before they can counter it. And yes, we were able to finish that match off. Stayed around 4,500 4, trophies. And maintain our positioning, so... At the rate we're going, I feel like... I feel like I'm going to get to 4,600. I just don't know how long it's going to take me. Because for the most part, I haven't been dropping trophies. I've been holding pretty good. But it's these last, like, 75 trophies I'm having a lot of trouble getting. All right. Potential rushing deck here. 
and I missed. Oh, I missed the lane. I was trying to play that in. Let's play the other one because the other boneyard because. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> so they counter with the arrows, and I'm lacking the right stuff here. I'm just gonna go with the uh, black witch. Yeah, not so good. But we'll we'll counter now the angel. Just trying to remove things that they've played. And then I will try and get my Spectre against that um, Executioner. Luckily, they didn't play the Shaman behind the Executioner. That's pretty interesting. So now I can counter the Shaman with the Black Witch and still do damage to their castle here. All right, let's go Skeleton's Legion. Give the Skull Queen some help. And give the Skull Queen some more help. I know I'm kind of ignoring my Valkyrie there, but... I just saw the opportunity here to get some cards played. And what else do we have? I can play the Catapult. They're not going to see that coming. Because <laughs> they just swapped lanes. And now uh, let's play Skull Queen and up the damage of the Skeletons. Uh-oh. I think I'm going to get this, though. Yes. Yes, yes. Oh, nice, nice, nice. Well played. So we're getting a lot closer. Well, I'm back to where I started the video. Okay. Okay. That's, you know, I've lost to a handful of decks because they have the dragon and the match drags on. And this deck is really meant to more win the match in like the mid game rather than the late game. So that's something I have to kind of take into account. Uh, hit the storm elemental. Please hit the storm elemental. No. And then, no. Oh my gosh, guys. I... If I had the, the Skull Queen right there, actually the Skull Queen is right here, so I might still be able to win this if I can get the Skull Queen played because they have a lot less health than I do. Come on, don't have arrows, don't have arrows, don't have arrows, but I need a block kind of still. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, so close, so close, so close, so close, so close. Oh no, what? What? Wow, well played, but... Ah, oh, these are such tough losses, guys. These are such tough losses. I was hoping this video wouldn't take too long to make, but yeah, every time I say that, and this isn't looking good here, they have a fortify. Oftentimes that means a spells type of deck, and those have not worked well for me. I've not had good luck against spell decks, but I do think I need to try and apply some pressure here while I can. How did that? Oh, I see. All right, so let's just really focus down. Try to do some damage to them. It's doing really good, really good damage. Let's keep it up. And let's get the Spectre in to capitalize on having the Skeletons out there. They're doing a lot of damage, but the last time I played someone like this, I did a ton of damage to them, and then they just came back. They came back, they got the Dragons out, and then I was toast. I was absolutely toast. I have to apply all the pressure, guys. All the pressure right here. If I don't, they're going to get, like, dragons out or something, and I will end up losing. So, all the pressure has to go down. Come on, catapult, catapult. Pressure has to get out there. All right, I'm going to go for the Valk. Yes. Yes. Okay. Back on the track here. So, let's get into the next match and see if we can improve upon that. Once they started to get out the really anti-skeleton cards like the Ice Elemental, the Mage, I was just in big trouble and I couldn't really seem to recover. So, let's go for Boneyard and see what they're going to respond with. I think I need to get out some of my more power cards here. Oh, man, really, they're going to go for that. Let's try for the Boneyard and see if we can get some damage in before, since they didn't complete. Ah, oh, I was like, I'm going to make them pay for not getting rid of the Skull Queen, but then that happens. So let's clear their Demon. And then we'll play another sort of dangerous card here with the... Catapult. I think this is too early for the catapult, but I'm not sure what I want to do just yet. Ah, really. I'm seeing so many gusts of wind. It's actually kind of interesting. 
Okay, we'll play Black Witch since they had that set up differently than I was anticipating. And then... Um, I'm going to go for the Valk, actually. And then we will go for the block over there. And <laughs> no, I think I'm going to have to play... I'm just going to try and play everything really quickly while I still have my Valk out there. It was my game plan. Now the Valk is down. Hmm... See, but this is one of those weird situations where they're starting to get an upper hand because I have some strange cards in my hand here. All right, now we go for the Black Witch. And really have to get rid of what they have there. That dragon, getting rid of the dragon was key. And now we have the lead here. Well played, that was a good game, honestly. Okay, let's keep trying to push, but I've literally been pushing for like an hour here and I'm getting nowhere. Granted, I haven't really lost trophies either, but I'm not progressing very well. So, I guess we'll go for that extra crystal, although it might have been better to save things. Yeah, let's, this is a good move here, because then I can play the specter and hopefully turn this come on no what where did that come from i should have seen that coming too this looks like a good play for me but um one move by them is gonna really throw me off here if they get any sort of move to destroy those skeletons i'm going to lose this match I'm going to try and block. And yes, we were able to get that. Well, I guess we'll go for the aggressive play. And try to just make them have to make some plays. That's good. That's good. I managed to get them to metamorph that. Wasting a play for them. And now we'll go for the uh, Skull Queen. Just to put some pressure there in the top lane on them. Um, and then now... Oh, it looks like we're going to get this, guys. It looks like we are going to pull it off. Are we really going to do this? We are going to do it. And there it is. There it is. Finally reaching 4,600 trophies. And a promotion to Master 3. Three league. Yes. Wow. What a trophy push in the past couple of days I've made uh, to increase my reward. I don't know if it increased it or not. I think it did. Packs of crystals 25 versus packs of crystals 20. So I increased it there. I didn't have to even upgrade any of my cards. I just had to play a little bit better. So looking pretty good there with that league. But it's going to be tough, though. 4,000 trophies, I mean, 400 trophies to be able to get to Grand Master 1. I think I could maybe do it, but given my highest previous trophies, I was only 200 away practically. So, I don't know. Anyways, uh, leave a like if you enjoyed. Let me know what you thought in the comments about this video and what other types of content I should create. Maybe subscribe if you're new to my channel. And thanks for watching, guys, and stay tuned for more videos.